Welcome to SmackDown Live, where we are closer to our pay-per-view event. And I don't know if some of our superstars can wait that long. There are rivalries that are ready to explode tonight. The collision course toward the pay-per-view event continues. But tonight, someone's going to hit a massive roadblock. I look at this card and my... This superstar ready for this matchup as we are too, Michael. Oh, and look at oh, oh. the double leg takedown. And now a right hand. Have run away. Brawl's underway. This superstar doesn't even care about a bell. This superstar just wants to fight. The official trying to separate these, these two, but to no avail. Yeah, good luck. shifted. Hurricane Rana. Oh, 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 man. Lana's transition from being Rusev's social ambassador to becoming a competitor in the women's division didn't necessarily go quite as Lana had hoped. Yeah, after weeks of anticipation, Lana finally made her singles debut at the Money in the Bank pay-per-view, only to be shut down by that woman, Naomi. And with the women's oh, division as white hot as it is right now, you just know this match is going to be one for the ages. As Byron said, Lana lost to Naomi at the 2017 Money in the Bank pay-per-view, and unfortunately for the ravishing Russian, things didn't get much better after that. No, no, they really didn't, Cole, but give Lana credit. I mean, she kept climbing into the ring with Naomi, despite losing each win every time. Oh, ooh, what impact. What a stop. Good grief. Naomi in trouble now. To be expected, though, given the competition she's in there with tonight. Pump the brakes a bit, Cole. I know exactly what you're thinking, and I can tell you with all certainty, she still has plenty of gas left in the tank. She's definitely slowing down here a bit. But that does mean it's the end of the road for her. Not by a long shot. Oh, a lot of able 
able to avoid damage. Beautiful technique. She goes for the cover. There's not a person in this arena who thought that that was it for him. Not yet. Gotta wonder how this is gonna end, Byron. Whatever happens, it's not gonna be good. I can tell you that. someone going against Naomi, and you're right. To try and level the playing field, an opponent must bring the pace of the match way down. An opponent must make slowing Naomi down the first order of business when the bell rings. Once Naomi gets in the driver's seat, it's almost impossible to slow her down. Then you see hashtag feel the glow trending on social media. damage one person cover cover the result this woman is showing right now is absolutely unreal wow i thought this was over drop down no she's too quick for her naomi feels awfully good about herself and the crowd does too Naomi feels awfully good about herself, and the crowd does, too. Oh, what impact! Get out of the way, Lana is rolling. Lana setting it up. you got to believe this one's over. He's back in full control now. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. She saw the opening and got the shoulder up. Lana is calling for it. She wants it one more. Ring rattling! Man, she knows how to make a comeback. There's a pin now. Two, three. Lana gets 
the win. That match is worth another look. Here we go. She's taking care of business. Here is your winner, the ravishing Russian, Lana. And that's the win to start off the night. And if that matches any indication of what to expect here tonight, we are in for an amazing evening. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. Team history was made when the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions were crowned at Backlash 2016. The unlikely duo of Rhino and Heath Slater caught lightning in a bottle and ran through the Tag Team Title Tournament. In the finals, Rhino and Slater took on the Usos to see which team would be the inaugural Tag Team Champions. There was a lot on the line in the Tag Team Tournament Finals. The Usos wanted to add another Tag Team title reign to their resume and enjoyed the recognition of being the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. The team of Rhino and Heath Slater was a team no one expected to be in the Finals. Slater had extra motivation because he was fighting for a WWE contract. And at one point, it seemed like the Usos had everything well in hand, but Rhino and Heath Slater refused to lose. After a gore from Rhino practically cut Jimmy Uso in half, Rhino and Heath Slater went from an unlikely tag team to the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. Never say never in WWE is absolutely right. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, that sets the tone for the rest of the match and your opponents are playing catch-up. The two out of three falls match that saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus was a throwback of sorts. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, championship title defenses and grudge matches were often decided in the two out of three falls format. Cesaro and Sheamus didn't waste any time and scored the decisive first fall after a world kick rocked Jeff Hardy. Cesaro and Sheamus wanted to continue their domination of Team Extreme, but the Hardys had other ideas as Matt tied things up at one fall apiece after a twist of fate on the Swiss sideboard. After a swanton bomb by Jeff Hardy, the match broke down and the third fall was ruled a double countout. Kick to the... the Usos have been considered the elite tag team in sports entertainment. On March 21st, 2017, Jay and his brother Jimmy added another trophy to their collection, the SmackDown Tag Team Ooh. Championship. They're not only expanding the Anawai family dynasty, they're building their own. have won different tag team championships during their tenure in WWE. 
But when they added the SmackDown Live Tag Team titles to the resume, they became just the fourth duo to hold the prizes that symbolized being SmackDown's top team. The Usos came to WWE to dominate sports entertainment together. Just days before WrestleMania 33, Jay and his brother Jimmy raised their game to take down American Alpha and begin their first reign as SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions. Got the oh, oh my goodness, crushing it! Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. When this guy's on, look out. He's calling for it. Jimmy Uso, so Man! Wow, what a will he be victorious? The pin's broken up. Ooh. He might have it. Jimmy Uso is getting beautiful technique. But he's got to capitalize now. And he's feeling his own now. He's making a statement here with this attack. Gets out of the way of that one. Looks like we're going to get the tag. The tag has been made. Oh, we needed that in the worst way, Michael. Hellacious power slam. Rowan, big move coming. Oh, what a combo. Can he finish the job? Here it comes. He's got him. Got the full Nelson. Slam with authority. That could be a Rowan going for an early pin. He's got plenty of gas left in the tank. He isn't going to go away that easy. Not today. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. How can Jay Russo be put on the offensive quickly here? His hopes of winning his tag team after starting to dwindle. He needs a breather in a bad way right now. If he could just make it to his corner and make the tag. Oh boy, he is rolling. Back suplex. Oh no. Oh, nasty impact. Is that it? Is it over? Talk about getting knocked into the middle of next week. They did it. Wow. What a match. And here's another quick look at those superstars in action in that tag team battle. Remember this? He's getting it done here. Here are your winners, Harper and Rowan, the Bludgeon Brothers. Big win here to start the show. If that's the type of action we're going to get all night long, I can't wait to see the rest of the card unfold. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more. Not quite sure what this superstar is doing there. The, the superstar in the ring is ready for action. Oh, now I get it, Corey. This superstar attacked the... I mean, this superstar wants to be part of the match. Well, the, the original competitor was, was attacked and ambushed him. Oh, if you're not given the opportunity you want, you just have to take it sometimes. This isn't even the scheduled match. What is going on here?
Becky Lynch may be slowing some here. But this certainly isn't something she can't come back from. Well, she certainly seems to favor being outside the ring. Though for the life of me, I cannot figure out why. traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. When I looked at the card for tonight, this one definitely stood out as one you don't want to miss. space for himself. And he's been gambling quite a bit here tonight. There's plenty of reward that goes along with being outside the ring as much as he has been, but there's a ton of potential risk. I think a lot of people right now are scratching their heads wondering how he let this match get so out of hand. The cover. And it's Randy Orton able to stop the count. Not yet. Call a bad landing. Look at this. Ooh, what impact. right now. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. He seems more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. What does Randy Orton need to do now? I'm not sure how much more he has to give. He's really starting to look fatigued here, guys, and when that happens, your whole body starts to give out on oh, him. He's going to need to be careful here. This is one of the more evenly matched contests we've seen in quite some time. From the looks of things, it could really go either way. The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. Got the shoulders down. And Benjamin easily gets the shoulder up. Benjamin with the world's greatest kick out right there. <laughs> Benjamin is so good. Elbow drop. Earsing. Remember Thursday, Raw Thursday? How many times do we need to say Thursday in one title? In any event, thanks for tuning in on this Thursday evening. 
Can he end it here? He could do it here. Yes! Takes it! And here's another glance of these superstars in action. Here is your winner. He is the Apex Predator, the Viper, Randy Orton. And that's the win to start off the night. And if that matches any indication of what to expect here tonight, we are in for an amazing evening. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks. Here we go, matchup's gonna be a good one. Superstar ready for action. Wasted a little time to start things off. There's the double leg takedown and the big right hands. Here we go, this thing's breaking down before it even gets started. Chaos ensuing here. Incredible. Boom. <laughs> it took some time for Shinsuke Nakamura to finally earn gold on the main roster in WWE. But he did so in emphatic fashion when he beat what Shinsuke Nakamura putting together here. Looks like he has other plans here. I think he was just looking to soften him up a little here. Knee drop. That was nasty. So precise. Putting it all on the line. Oh, from the top. Cover here. Plenty of fight left. Not yet. Not looking good. This could end it in a hurry. I don't think he's got it completely locked in. He fights his way free. But how much energy did he exhaust fighting his way out? Oh, low blow. Too quick for him there. What a stop. Good grief. Wow, Jeff Hardy gets the reversal. You've got to believe this one's over. Oh, hanging off for dear life. And a slam. technique he's got plenty of gas left in his tank remarkable himself in a tough spot. His hopes of winning this match appear to be dwindling in a hurry. This is where we find out who the better man is. And at this point, it could very well be either one of these guys. That's how close this thing is. He's going for it all. Jeff Hardy's going for it. I'm not sure how much he has left. That is a huge opportunity. Is that enough for the win? Kick out. Hey, I guess you never know. Shinsuke Nakamura beginning to breathe a little heavy now. I'd 
say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. That confidence he had on his face at the start of this match sure has disappeared, and with good reason. He's taken quite a beating. It's make or break time here, and he absolutely has to find a way to get back on the offensive if he wants to win this match. Can he score the pin? This guy's a competitor. He's not going down yet. WWE's resident rock star pops the shoulder up there. Jeff Hardy just barely getting out of the way. So quick. Slam down hard. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Oh, continuing to punish them. Lariat. Whoa, down he goes. That was impressive, Cole. Shinsuke Nakamura just too fast for him. It's like trying to fight smoke. What a strike. Surprise reversal from Jeff Hardy. He breaks out. He's not done just yet, Michael. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. Shoulders on the back. No, they're not done yet. Not even close. Jeff Hardy just refuses to fade away tonight. Oh man, that hurt. Yeah, let's hope he can keep this kind of effort going. And verdict power slam. Wow. The King of Strong Style with a massive slam. Shinsuke Nakamura. This one is over. There may be no coming back from that slam, Cole. Effectively using the knee. <laughs> oh, man! Kinshasa! But he's running up. We got a couple. Two! Three! And that does it. Shinsuke Nakamura captures the win. These superstars put on quite a show. Here's another look. He ain't playing here. Oh, I can't believe this. Here is your winner. Kicking off the night with an impressive victory. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the main event. What a way to kick off the night. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. You know, guys, being called the face that runs the place is not a title you can just give yourself. It absolutely is. It. It's a monster AJ Styles earned when he took on WWE's flag bearer, John Cena. I like to call Byron the face that ruins the place. When I looked at the card for tonight, this one definitely stood out as one you don't want to miss. Bringing up John Cena reminds me of how bitter his and AJ Styles' rivalry was and how it produced match of the year candidates. They are two of the best in this business, Cole. It'd be difficult not to be match of the year. At the time, Styles had a lot to prove to the WWE Universe and did so by being phenomenal. Look who it is! Yep, these two 
can't stand each other. I wonder if John Cena knew his career would change forever when he put on a rapper costume for SmackDown's Halloween party in 2002. But he showed he could spit rhymes and it worked to get the attention of his opponents. So the doctor of thugonomics was born. Going for broke. Cena's study of thugonomics. Here we go. John Cena setting it up. Oh boy, he is rolling. Is he? And he breaks free just when you thought he was out of this one. DDT! Fight him. AJ Styles caught a bit off guard there. Which is a rare sight. I want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. He just yeah. has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. Oh, we crossed the shoulder. We're going to see it. Oh, oh my oh. goodness. Draped across the top rope. <laughs> He'd be smart to stay put there. Look at this. John Cena starting to show signs of fatigue. He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. I'd never count this guy out, but I'll tell you what. He's not looking so hot right now. He's really going to need to find a way to get back in this thing. Yeah, I'm sure he saw things going differently for him here tonight, but that clearly isn't the case, unfortunately for him. When this guy's on, look out. Near a count out here, Corey. It would be a shame if this ends in a count out, Cole. Sunset bomb! Wow. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Ooh, John Cena's taking a beating, and he could be out at any moment now. It's about as bad as it gets for him. WWE.com poll had him as the overwhelming favorite leading into this match, but he's definitely not looking like the favorite so much right now. If anyone can make a big comeback, you know it's John Cena. I think we're about to see it. I can't wait. I love this. Step through. Styles Clash. I don't know. Is that enough to stop Cena? Vicious strike. Right on the mark. Oh, a debilitating elbow drop. Uh-oh, here comes a phenomenal one. Styles has him up. Ushi Garoshi. I don't know. Is that enough to stop Cena? Yeah, you don't want to get dropped like that. That's for sure. And he got a near fall out of it. Wow, what's it going to take? I think AJ Styles is done playing. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Assault on the lower back. If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. That slam just brought this entire arena to its feet. Digging deep for a kick out. He isn't going to go away that easy. Looking at it here. Trying to make a... This could be it. Oh, my. Are we looking at yet another John Cena victory here? John Cena is taking charge of this match. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Uh oh, and that's the impact. I don't know. 
that enough? To... AJ Styles right now is taking hold of this match. He could be closing in on a victory. He's making a statement here with this attack. Looking for it. Submission move. Oh, uh, there it is. It's in. The cat crusher. I don't know. Is that enough to stop Cena? Hopefully John Cena can recover. And John Cena's definitely getting in people's heads here. And that's how a superstar takes advantage of their ring position. Such a high ring IQ. Big slam. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh, that'll mess up the neck. Styles looking to end this thing. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Harsh impact. Cena ready to close it out. You can't see me. And the five knuckle shuffle. Boom. Are we looking at yet another John Cena victory here? Wow, I thought for sure that was it. AJ Styles with a nice reversal. Ooh. Here we go, John Cena. Attitude adjustment. Are we looking at yet another John Cena victory here? Unbelievable. This singles match is over. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. He's getting after it here. Winner, John Cena! And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. If that's the type of action we're going to get all night long, I can't wait to see the rest of the card unfold. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks.